Hi. Uh, last night, yes. After watching uh, Anna Rosa video about the uh, tamu tamanu oil, I decided to make my versions. Uh, since I have just finished my my mixtures. Uh, my trip to Japan this time, I'm trying to get a spray bottle. This is a spray bottle, but um, because this one is actually is like um, aromatics uh, water, like rose petal water, and the spray bottle is not really working for oil. And I'm trying to find some which can be like ha have a proper spray, which not just a circle but over all my face. I I couldn't find it. Okay. So today I'm going to use my leftover uh, Chantecaille. This is a, a pure rose water. Okay, and hopefully this cover can hold well because it's just, it don't have any sc screw on it. Yep. So normally what I do is either I put uh, mineral water, I spray my uh, event in it. Or I use purified water from my machine uh, or some lavender uh, lavender water or rose water as a base water base what I do is I will every time I use slightly different mixtures like uh, sometimes I use rose hip oil, uh, jojoba oil, and sometimes uh, just mix and match. But I will put this uh, tamanu in it. I just finished, I think, more than a quarter, almost half. Okay, but I don't have any measurements, so. You can see the oil. It's inside. And then I will put some. Um, this is the sea bakthon. I just squeeze some in. I sometimes will use it as um, what you call like makeup remover. I just spray a wet. Uh, this is the uh, facial treatment uh, rose oil from Aesop. And some of the this is the Karen's. You can see from from the bottle, the Tamanu oil is a little bit heavier than the others oil. That means you can see the green color is on the bottom. That's it. Uh, in proportions, I prefer a um, little bit more water than the oil, just lightly. Okay, hopefully, 
this cover can stay properly okay and then I just shake them so every time I use it I have to shake it before I use it's become like this avocado oil or look like a whatever let's try this spray oh this worked mm. okay because it's more like water based so I feel this more like uh, more watery so I will just pat for lip to absorb the first layer first I found like getting wrinkles around this area especially when I wake up <sighs> you see very fast it's separate again so every time I use it I have to shake it before I spray if you prefer more oily uh, textures like you'd like to feel like you're putting more oil on it so you don't you don't need to mix with any water but the thing is I if I use this to make up I remove my eye makeup I can only remove it uh, remove my eye shadow if I remove my mascara uh, it irritate my it's went into my eyes and it's quite hurting okay so be careful if you really uh, okay I just show you this is I just use it to remove my makeup before I shower just one cotton pad I spray the wet and then just massage uh, since it, since I'm not using very heavy uh, makeup I haven't tried if I use very heavy makeup maybe I, I need to use two cotton pads instead of one to remove all the makeup and yesterday I just used this um, this and in the morning sometimes I just same thing after I wash my face uh, sometimes if I found my skin has uh, in the morning I feel like I have that skin something like that I will use a cotton pad with some uh, not too thick uh, toner I will just not pat I will just do like this to rub the I feel like more cleaner and then after doing that and then I will fit, flip over the cotton pad and do patting motions then I will put this oil spray because I'm lazy like this is much more faster uh, I can feel this is it slickiness around my face mm, but I don't feel oil okay not oily and not sure this thing can can eat the rose water is fine uh, the tamanu I think is fine uh, only the carrots uh, I am not sure the uh, sea bakthon I think is drinkable so I just spray it like this and then I will put uh, sunblock 
and then um, after the sunblock I will put up my uh, makeup like foundations or CC cream if I put CC cream normally I don't use sunblock now since the CC cream has uh, high PA in it and some some people are confusing like what is the difference between the SPF and the PA as I know SPF is to control not to like the uh, the higher SPF meaning that you will not uh, like color you will not get tan okay but PA++ is the spot and the anti-aging thing please correct me okay so PA++ I normally will if I have a choice I rather have low SPF but high uh, PA4 plus on it I don't mind getting 10 but I do mind have all the spot and aging problem color is not my problem uh, since this 10 years is it more than 10 years yes I can't get 10 I remember when I gave birth of my daughter meaning about uh, 13 years ago uh, right after I gave birth about when she was a year old or less than a year old um, my sisters and her husband in that time uh, we went to uh, Bali Indonesia so I'm thinking of because of the just after giving birth is I'm much more bigger than now like the skin everything is so fluffy <laughs> my sister described me as a Michelin man you know that Michelin man <laughs> and I'm wearing bikini even in these sections of fat what the heck no one knows me right I'm trying to tan myself I'm putting some uh, uh, low SPF things to to we call it some a black man oil they call it okay so when you apply it is definitely give you color and the dark darker darkest darkest tan you will have so we tan for two two days straight <laughs> maybe half a tone darker just slightly around now maybe slightly more darker doesn't help but before maybe 20 years ago just one afternoon I can not afternoon just one hour 10 I can turn to very healthy skin tone just an hour but now days weeks month yeah I'm not able to t to darken my skin you can see like my face already darker than my hands now uh, that's it I can't go darker than this I think I watch uh, one of the uh, who is that? Uh, Mariah Carey. She like tense color on her face and things, but her hands also not so tan. But it's good when you have dark hands. It look old actually. Um, you see, it's. Mm. If you see me have improvement on my skin, maybe it's the Tamanu that Steve uh, introduced to me. Um, so, 
I ordered this from iHerb and now it's half gone I will almost times to uh, it took uh, a week time to ship from US to Hong Kong and I rather bought from iHerb than Amazon is because of the shipping costs Amazon is so expensive in shipping it seems like getting more and more expensive like uh, I just ordered some color pencil my my daughter wanted uh, sh because her classmate um, the, the grandparents or something is they, 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 they from UK but the grandparents living in in uh, Australia and they they bought her the color pencil the big BIC the marker the marker itself is not too expensive about 20 it's less than $20 I believe but the shipping is the price of the color marker but I can't do anything she wants it uh, she makes use of it uh, let her try otherwise like the color pencil plus the shipping actually is almost the cost of a professional color marker already and last time when I mentioned that about uh, uh, muscle pain and someone commented like uh, reply and say like they also have this problem isn't it because of the menopause things the perimenopause um, before is my left arm like pain I can't raise my hands now I, I now I can but can't really uh, carry heavy things and is the problem is is on the shoulder so I think it's also because of the teeth uh, crunching things because when you read the teeth crunching you will also have problem with your beside migraine or headache you will also because of the nerves uh, here become so stiff so my son told me that my arm like I can't lift my arms it's not my joint problem it's not my arm problem is here my shoulder around this area this sections so after he telling me this since I told you that my son can see the color right he told me it's this problem so I just used a massage chair to massage this area then I found out uh, you know the, the the massaging chair when they press they do the like that I found that when they hit certain point I can feel my nerve is like here now this is fine but this one having problem I can't lift it this is the highest my arm can go it's so pain now <laughs> And just now when I'm using massage chair, same problem here. Okay, please tell me if you have the solution for this. Okay, good night. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>